Another beautiful day. Good morning to the Groove Crew. Good morning to my cutties. Yeah. I like that. What's going on, gang? How my Groove Crew doing this morning, man? Hopefully everybody's feeling beautiful. Hopefully everybody's having a great morning so far. Um, you already know where I'm headed. <laughs> yeah, man. Finally headed to work. Um, it's Wednesday, man. It's one day closer to my weekend. Tomorrow, tomorrow is Friday for me. You feel me? So uh, I'm excited about that. Uh, hold on, guys. I'm gonna put on my seatbelt, guys. How dare you try to keep me safe, guys? So uh, gravy. But yeah, man. So I got a question for my groove crew this morning. Let's see. So I was talking to my brother yesterday, and I was letting him know. I was like, man, bro. I think I'm really about to embrace this groovy Drew. You know what I mean? Like me changing my name on uh, YouTube was semi a big deal for me because um, as y'all know, I did YouTube before on the same channel. Go back and watch some of those old videos, man. They're pretty good if you ask me. Um, I did YouTube before and that was more like, you know, fitness, lifestyle, vlog type deal, you know, and a couple things here and there. But uh, Maddie Drew Live was, the name that I had came up with a long time ago, man. And it was attached to my journey and attached to, you know, something, uh, the beginning of something great. <clears throat> However, Groovy Drew is, it's like the second coming of Maddie Drew Live, but even better. You know what I mean? Like I'm older now, I got more experience and um, I have a way better grip on what it is that I want to achieve and what it is I want to do. So I said I'm about to I'm about to attack Groovy Drew and you know really get this thing popping and get this thing lifted off the ground like a helicopter. Right? So I wanted to know from the Groove crew if y'all think I should create a jingle or a uh a intro outro type song for this channel. You already know that I can get the bars going. You already know that I got flow, I can sing, I got range, you know what I mean? Like hold on, let me show you. Okay, 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 okay. Today is Wednesday, it's kind of fun. Today I'm gonna go out and look at the sun. I don't care if I go blind, I don't care if I go deaf. One thing I know is that I need rest. My name is Groovy Drew and I'm better than the best. I'm the best of the best and you cannot test it. Cause if you test it, you will be neglected. And if you get neglected, then your ass can get stepped in. Hey, hey. It's divide and conquer, crabs in the barrel. I divide my monsters, yeah, to different rooms. My name is Groovy Drew. Somebody give me a spoon, hey, so I can get me some cereal. Or I can eat some soup with a fork. My name is Groovy Drew, three U's. If you forget the three U's, then your ass is a dork. Uh, I really like this beat. Hey, I'm about to put it on repeat. Hey, uh. Don't ask me because I don't remember what I did last week. Hey, uh, Valentine's Day is next week. Hey, yeah, who got some fresh sheets? Hey, yeah, who lay it next to me? Hey, yeah, that's my girl. You can see. Hey, yeah. Oh! <laughs> hey, man. Hey, I was flowing a little bit, huh? I was flowing a little bit. <laughs> oh, hey, make sure y'all screen grab that and post it on y'all's story and uh, tag me at Groovy Drew. Let's get to work. <laughs> uh, my boy Player just dropped a new track, man. He actually dropped it while I was on my way to work, so I just bought it and I had to listen to it. I'm like, hmm, I think I got an idea for this song. Yes, sir. Listen to this. All this smoke up in my body, I can feel your lungs. Me and you share the bitch, but I'll make a cut. Mm -hmm. Vulgar. Nah, man, but I just got to work. I've been sitting in my car for about 15 minutes. And just pondering, thinking about thinking about the day, what it is I got to do. And uh, ready to attack the day, man. So, 
let's go ahead and get to it, Cuddies. We can do this. All right. What's going on, Groove Crew? What's going on to my Cuddies, man? Listen, it is 6 o'clock, and your boy is just leaving work, okay? I'm just leaving work at 6 o'clock. Y'all, we do not do that. But I digress. We had what is referred to as an emergency at work, and it's still going on right now, but Groovy got to go, okay? Um, but yeah, so I've been here for hours and hours and hours, I and mean, you don't believe me, you can see the, the sunset, you know what I mean? Like, look at, the, look at the sky, look at the sky. All right, family, so right now, I just left work, and I'm on a goddamn scavenger hunt right now. Uh, my boy, I got a couple artist friends, but my friend uh, Trey, specifically the Broham Trey, follow him on Instagram. He uh, he does scavenger hunts. Uh, he does scavenger hunts for his like prints that he uh, prints out, and uh, he posts them all around the city. I was close to one that he just did, so I'm currently on my way over there to see if it's still available, see if I can find it. Wish me luck. It was in a planner's box. So I just gotta find exactly where this nigga was. And we can go from there. All right, the way it's looking right now, it ain't looking, it's not looking good. Let me see, gotta check Instagram again. Let's see. So the one that he did that I'm currently at is this one right here. So the post and then bam right there you see that movie theater right there that's exactly where i'm at that's exactly where i am let me zoom there you go you see that look movie theater let's see that one that one it's the exact same one so it's up to me to use my Spidey senses and my Sherlock Holmes skills to see if I can find this. Cause I do want these prints. So let's see. Y'all, I found it. I ain't never won one of these, man. Trey done did this like five times cause I ain't never won. Check it out. I've never won one, bro. So this is coming home with Drew. Let's see. Uh, so here we go. Uh, we got some sauce so we got the lightning mcqueen the cars family and i think those is uh pajama what the hell are them things called if you know the name of this car uh the kid cartoon right here let me know it's like pajama pets or something like that and then he got a gang of stickers so like i said man y'all go follow my boy at the bro ham tray he got a gang of stuff man go check him out look i ain't never won I've been trying to win one of these forever, and I never won. Let's go, baby. I ain't never won. Shout out me. Cool, man. In a day that's uh, in a day that's filled with, you know, unfortunateness, you know, with work and everything, it's uh, it's nice to be able to get a W, and it just added some content to the vlog. So <laughs> that's a dub. Y'all think we could break into the movies? I don't think so popcorn probably still anyway yep all right so let me mess y'all head up real quick because i'm actually like pretty geeked about this uh about finding the scavenger hunt and i'm gonna tell you why so i've always wanted to win one of my boys scavenger hunts you know i've, I've purchased pieces from him but i've purchased pieces from him before but he does these scavenger hunts it's super cool like he get the whole city involved he go from one part of the city all the way across town and like anybody that knows sacramento sacramento got a bunch of like little cities around it that's also included in sacramento it's called the greater sacramento area right but i was at work i just left work like 10 minutes ago right and if i didn't stay to finish my work if i wasn't at work for as long as i was i never would have had the opportunity to get this scavenger hunt fine you know what i mean and so it's crazy how it, like where where my attitude was at first was like dang man i'm still at work you feel me like and this sucks Boop, boop, boop. Like, I wish I could go home, right? But 
at the end of it all, I ended up getting something that I actually wanted out of it because I was, I just so happened to be coming down the street. I checked my phone, when I, which I wasn't supposed to be doing. So, Ma, if you're watching this, wasn't supposed to be doing it. But guess what? I did. And I got a, got, I got a scavenger piece out of it. But I'm checking my phone while I'm driving. And I got, you know, I got the little clue of where it was. And I was like, man, I literally was right at the light. I can't make this up. I literally was right at the light. And I was like, oh, right there? I was passing the light up. The light was green. I said, skirt. And I made the left. And I came in here. And I'm over here skirt searching and driving around. I say that to say, you know, sometimes, like, that's a big life lesson for me, honestly. Something, something so small was just a, was a less, lesson. Was a lesson. Like, it's all about your perspective on things. You know what I mean? Like, I could have chose to make that a negative experience. But... Or seen it as a negative experience, but instead I seen the positive in it, which was me getting something that I wanted out of an uh, out of a situation that was least desirable earlier on, right? So sometimes you got to do things you don't want to do so you can do the things that you want to, you know what I mean? Or sometimes you just got to do things you don't want to do, and sometimes you might be blessed with something that you want later on because you did what you didn't want to. I'm sure y'all know where I'm at by the by the uh, street light. Look, I'm back at my parents' house. My dad gonna be like, Nikki, you came back? Look, go ahead, just cancel your lease and come back home because you're over here every day anyway. But I'm not coming. And I tried not to do it on the last light, but you know I gotta do it on this one. <laughs> Hi, Matthew. How you doing? Really? You just come in with the camera on? I would have been the crew, been like, hey, what's up, man? <laughs> yeah, right. Town, I'm out. Please make it home safe. All right, family. So I just left the parents' house. I went over here to see if I had a package. I was expecting the package to be delivered today, but it wasn't. So, busted mission. This is nice. Now, I'm debating if I want to watch something on Netflix. Or if I just want to play a mindless game of Madden. I'm thinking Madden. Yeah. And I do have Madden 21. Don't play me. It's like, it's right over there somewhere. Yeah. Madden 21 is right there. Shout out to the big toe. So, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm going to give me a game of Madden in. I'm about to start cooking my dinner right now. Got some tilapia and some rice coming up. It's a good night, man. It's a real good night. They done got y'all Cuddy back in his bag, boy. I got the game. I got the interception. I'm down three. All right, two minutes left. I'm down three. Watch how your Cuddy work. Watch how your Cuddy work. Hold on. Uh, I lost the ball. A fumble. I got the stop on. I got the stop on third down to force fourth down, and he gonna just run the clock out for the fit. <laughs> and then the nigga missed the field goal. Wow. You know what? <laughs> I'm done. Hey, it was fun though. I'm trash, bro. I can't believe I lost. I got greedy, man. Got greedy, but I was kicking his ass for the longest. God, leave, boy. It's all good. I'm gonna run it back eventually. I'm gonna run it back with him. You know, I'm a loser in the Madden. I'm a winner in real life. My mama even said I'm a winner. But I do got dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Did I say winner, winner, tilapia dinner? I got some tilapia and rice right there. I ate my vegetables already because today was just one of them days where you just get the vegetables out the way, okay? Um, but yeah, man, you know, today was a good day. Tomorrow's my Friday, so hopefully we have a better day at work and we don't have any emergencies happen. Um, but yeah, I'll be in touch with y'all. So yeah, man, it's your boy Groovy Drew, 3 U's, and I will see y'all tomorrow for another vlog. Peace!